Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Acer Nitro 17 AN1741. If you want to have a look at the internals of this laptop, you need to undo 11 Phillips head screws. After that, you can pry the bottom plate with a plastic tool, or you can pop up the bottom by carefully lifting it while holding securely the two plastic exhaust vents on the back. Please remember, it would be of great help to us if you just hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would motivate us to make even more and better videos for you. The battery isn't held in place with screws because there is a dedicated socket for it on the inside of the bottom panel that is keeping the unit fixed. The battery is a 90.61 watt hour variant. To remove it, just pull out the connector from the main board and you can lift the unit away from the chassis. It lasts for 20 hours of web browsing or 9 hours and 5 minutes of video playback. This is an astonishing result for a gaming laptop. It looks like when the optimization is good, the Zen 4 CPUs can be pretty efficient. If you want to achieve these numbers, you have to apply the Optimus mode in the BIOS. For storage, there are two M.2 slots compatible with Gen 4 SSDs. There are two SODIMs for up to 32 gigabytes of DDR5, 5600 MHz RAM in dual channel mode. The devices with refreshed Zen 3 Plus CPUs are limited to 4800 MHz RAM speed. The memory stick is additionally cooled by a thermal pad. The cooling looks promising. It has two fans, two heat pipes shared between the processor and the graphics card, one additional pipe for the CPU, and two more for the GPU. The system is also complemented by two large cooling plates and four heat sinks.